here with Fox 13 News. We've been tracking Antifa for a long time. He was just down there at President's Circle and they were handing out sharp objects to stab people with, said they had someone coming with an AK. Why did it take two late night hosts, comedians, to find this out? I, you know what, I wish you guys luck. Marley was dead to begin with. Okay, there you go. Verifiable proof that Antifa is premeditatedly and proactively violent. And you'll see more in this video than you've probably ever seen before. The kinds of attacks they plot, how they coordinate, what tools they use. Even more importantly, you'll see a complicit media who, when offered this very footage, turned the other way. How do we know all this? Because we've been infiltrating this organization for a long time. Hard. But first, you'll need a primer. Protests, violence, riots, calling everyone a Nazi. This is the MO of Antifa. We've all seen it, but the media, politicians, and academia all defend, deflect, or completely deny. They are strictly principled anti-fascists. What we saw were some brave people risking their lives. That group protests fascism. Maybe their tactics weren't exactly right. It's messy. Antifa are people who go and they try to push back on these guys, but it is not the case that they are going around building an armed movement. Fascism cannot be defeated through speech. You need to take it with the utmost seriousness before it's too late. Black Lives Matter, the Antifa movement is interested in preserving the fabric of America. Antifa is one of those things that somebody came up with as a catchphrase so that you could say, you know, oh, there is violence on the other side. 